trading with smart money concept offers a profitable edge by aligning yourself with the smart institutional traders. These experienced players often move the market with their large-scale investments and by following their footprints, you can ride the waves of their movements. When you understand the concepts and strategies of smart money, you are essentially looking at the market through their eyes. This allows you to anticipate their moves and position yourself accordingly. What I said is, when you follow institutional footprints, it means that you're positioning yourself just to anticipate institutional moves in the market. So what I'm basically going to do in today's lesson is that I'm going to show you how you can position yourself in order to trade in line with the institutions, in order to follow institutional footprints to make money from the financial markets. Last two weeks, I talked about how to trade trend reversal. And if I try to zoom out, you're going to see this was the particular lesson. And if you look over here, we have the exact same pattern repeating itself. And if you actually took advantage of what I explained last two weeks, you would have made money from the financial markets. This is good. And this is the 30 minutes time frame. Now, what I'm basically going to explain in today's lesson is simply showing you how to follow institutional footprints how you can position yourself to trade in line with the institutions and when we talk about institutions right here there are different ways we can actually identify institutional footprints in the market firstly you need to identify where liquidity is resting in the market identify area of liquidity and understand that price we always take liquidity and we always seek for liquidity the second thing you need to understand is institutional candle when you see an institutional candle things that make up institutional candle is large candles that has price inefficiency so let me show you some examples in this particular lesson now if you try to look from here you can clearly see that price has been in an uptrend you see this is gold right here and you see that gold has been trending up now at this point we saw an unusual move because from what you've been seeing gold has been offering higher highs you see we have a higher high right here we have a higher low if you look here this is our higher low right here we have a higher high so gold has been printing higher highs and higher lows moving in continuation to the upside offering higher prices but at this point we have a price action that is a little bit different from what price has been offering and one thing you have to understand is that we have a liquidity sweep right here and if you look at this particular area you're going to see that we have a liquidity sweep and when you see a liquidity sweep in the market this is a sign that institutions have stepped into the market this is a sign that institutions are stepping into the market because they will always seek for liquidity. Now, this movement actually happened last week during NFP. So, what you see is that price sweeps the liquidity above this high. You see, after price takes the liquidity above this high, then we have that massive reaction to the downside. Now, this massive reaction to the downside cause what we call a market structure shift and when we identify a market structure shift this simply means that you're going to have possible change in trend or a trend reversal we equally have what we call institutional candle where we have large candles that has price inefficiency so this is the whole setup right here this is the whole trading opportunity okay identifying your liquidity sweep you see at first you see this candle right here and you can clearly see this bullish candle this bullish candle swept the liquidity above this high this bullish candle right here it took the liquidity above that high now this helps you understand that this bullish candle right here is your order block which you're going to trade from because it was this candle that initiated the move to the downside after price sweeps the liquidity above the high you see that institutional move to the downside so this is the whole trading opportunity so let me mark a zone so you know what institutional patterns looks like if you want to trade institutional pattern we have this other block right here this is our other block right here and you see we have price inefficiency over here and the market structure shift so these are the confluence you need to trade this and if you look right here here could serve as your inducement area if you're looking to trade from this particular level and another thing you have to keep in mind is that zones can be refined okay sometimes when you mark your zones you could decide to refine your zone depending on your own preference you can decide to use a bigger zone or a smaller zone if you're looking at trading opportunities before we play price forward one thing i want to bring to your understanding is that most times you might not really be able to catch this first institutional move right here except you're trading with a different strategy if you're trading or trying to follow institutional footprints you might not be able to catch this first initiation to the downside what you're going to wait is for the retest when price is coming to retest the order block that is when you're going to get involved in the market now playing price forward to see how price reacts to this particular area now you see we have a retracement to the downside which confirms this area as our inducement area now you see i always say that price will always come to seek liquidity now price comes back to this inducement area at first we have the sweep and a retracement back into the range now finally price moves higher to mitigate our other block and if i try to play this forward you're going to see 
how price mitigates that other block and continue blasting to the downside you see how price reacts massively to the downside and this is how to follow institutional footprint one thing you have to note is that this particular trading opportunity i saw this trading opportunity with my vip students and this opportunity was shared to the free telegram community i want to use this opportunity to announce our mentorship which will be coming up on september so our mentorship will be coming up on september this is born to trade advanced smart money course and this is what you're going to get if you enroll for this mentorship you're going to have access to advanced smart money course you're going to be part of our weekly chart breakdown you're going to be part of our support community that is our vip community we're going to be sharing premium possible trading opportunities and you'll be part of our weekly zoom meeting okay now if you want to read more about this mentorship you can click on see more and this is where you can actually decide to make payment to enroll for a mentorship and have it in mind that this mentorship costs 216 dollars after now you're going to increase it back to the original price which is 320 dollars and have it in mind that you're going to have lifetime access to our advanced smart money course if you are enrolling for this mentorship so all you have to do to enroll for this mentorship is visit our website at www.bontotrade.com and um, you can clearly see that the trade has double e right here so do where to enroll for a mentorship and be part of our vip community now this is it and from there we had price reacting to the downside and we're having good price actions today and while i was explaining i said that sometimes you can decide to apply what i call zone refinement so i am my team we missed trading from this particular level because of zone refinement because when we're actually looking at this particular zone we had analysis we're actually looking at this particular area we refined our zone this way so that's why we missed the opportunity so this is what it looks like when i shared it to our free community so this is our free community right here this was the setup when i shared it to the free community and this was the update right here when i said the setup was actually valid but price already mitigated the whole other block i was actually expecting a pullback into the other block before the continuation to the downside but we didn't actually get that so we missed that trading opportunity now i'll be showing you more examples and have it in mind that every example i'm going to show you is a personal trade i took with those in our vip community so let me show you more examples and how you can actually apply this concept to make money from the financial markets so here is another trading opportunity this one was also shared to our vip community so in this particular one we can clearly see that price has been trending down and one thing i said you should be able to identify is when institutions are changing their footprints in the market when they are looking at other options in the market because you can clearly see over here that we have that push to the downside which actually broke structure to the downside and after that you see price reversing to the outside so immediately price reversed to the outside this automatically turns into a liquidity sweep where price stays the liquidity at this equal lows right here so when price took this liquidity we have the reaction to the upside which confirms this level as a market structure shift now when we had the market structure shift you can clearly see and identify this as the institutional candle because these candles reacted to the upside with momentum now looking to trade from this area this is a whole other block right here and this particular trade i took this one with my vip student so let me show you what it looks like so this is what the setup looks like when we had meeting uh, with my vip students and it was shared to our community so this is the exact same setup when it was shared so when we got the whole of this trading opportunity having the confluence that make it a high probability trading opportunity now we have a liquidity area so in this case what price is building right here is a trend line liquidity so we have the trend line liquidity and this is all the confluence we need to approach this particular setup now playing price forward and you see price mitigates our zone and you see that massive reaction to the upside and personally i made four percent from this particular trading opportunity let me show you more example so here is another trading opportunity which we had and just like i said i always work with my team and our vip students so what you can clearly see from here is that we have an institutional candle and another important confluence you have to note is that we have a liquidity sweep price takes the liquidity a reaction to the upside and you can decide to mark here as your market structure shift now over here you can clearly see that we have some inducement areas which we could mark where price could seek liquidity from and where is our zone where are we going to trade from this is our zone right here okay this is the level we're going to trade from and you can agree with me that this zone could be refined if you look to refine to this week okay so this is the whole trading opportunity let me still show you on our vip channel so use this usd card the setup when it was shared to our vip okay this is what it looks like right here now playing price for to see how price reacts to this 
now price comes back to mitigate our level price comes back deeper and we have a good reaction to the upside but the thing is that we only made three percent from this particular setup price only offered three percent before we see the reversal to the downside now that we have a reversal to the downside and you see price reacted with an institutional candle to the downside we have a new trading opportunity and this is where we'll be looking to trade because our bias is already shifting okay so this is it about how to understand the concept and strategies of smart money just like i said this allows you to anticipate their moves anticipating where the institutions have positioned themselves and this will help you position yourself to trade in line with their footprints okay so this is it and i hope you got value from this lesson if you got value you can consider dropping a like and a comment on this lesson and if you have interest in joining or enrolling for a mentorship the link is in the description and you can look to join us today thanks very much for watching this one see you in the next lesson